What's up YouTube? This is Luis here and guess what? Today it's raining and you know what that means? We can't skate today. <laughs> But on the bright side, the one thing I do want to talk to you guys about is that we are going to review the best wheels in the world, Spitfire Formula 4s. The truth. So currently, this is my skateboard right now. Um, this is my whole setup, as you guys can see. But uh, right here is I have my Spitfire Formula 4s. They were uh, 52 millimeters, you know, but they're definitely not 52 millimeters anymore because I've been using them for over a year and I don't think they're like 52 millimeters. I would say they're good like 45 maybe. All that power sighting, all that drifting, all that ollies. But these wheels are like by far, I personally think are the best wheels ever for skateboarding. So what I'm going to do right now is that I'm going to take out these wheels and I'm going to show you a good uh, run through of what these wheels are. You know, oh, you can definitely see uh, how small these wheels are. Funny story is I couldn't find my uh, skate tool, not even my brother's skate tool. So I dug in my dad's garage and uh, I found these right here. So, you know, I'm going to do it the old fashioned way and take out the nut uh, right here. So uh, wish me luck. So I think the wrench I need to get is this one right here. Let me see what size. One half, okay a half, I think this one will might fit, so uh, let's go find out. Okay actually, it does fit. I don't know if you guys see that, but it is turning, so we're gonna take out these wheels and we're gonna go check them out after one year of uh, usage. All right, there goes the first wheel. Here comes the second wheel. All right. All right, let's flip the thing over. Okay, actually I'm gonna have to lay it down this way because it's gonna be kind of hard because every time I lay it on the side where there's no wheel, it doesn't stand still. So I'm gonna have to take it off like this. All right, here comes the third wheel. And on to the last one. Alright, last and not least, the last wheel. Alright, so now I'm gonna move this skateboard to the side for right now on my bed. And I'm gonna bring these. And we're gonna take a good look at these uh, Spitfire Formula 4s and see how they performed in one year. Wow, would you look at that? It's already a little uh, chip coming off. I don't know if you guys see that right there. Right here. Wow, these are definitely not <laughs> 52 millimeters. I like how they still have, look at that. You could still, um, look at that. You could still read it right there where it says 52 millimeters. I think these were uh, 99 Adron. No, oh, these are 101s. That's what they are. Um, honestly, I personally think these are the best skateboard wheels ever. 101 uh, Duro polyurethane classic 52 millimeters uh, formula fours spitfires these are honestly the best wheels i've ever skated i've skated other wheels such as uh force wheels um honestly these are the best skateboard wheels i have ever skated in my life okay so i'm gonna whip out the measuring tape and uh, just to let you guys know that uh one centimeter has 10 millimeters so i'm gonna about to measure one wheel and see how much they are now and see how much of a beating these took after one year of skating all right so i'm going to show you guys right here so i don't know if you guys can see but i'm measuring and these are like mm, like four and a half or a little less than four and a half centimeters so i'm guessing that's like that is going to be less than a uh, 45 uh millimeters so these were 50 uh what these were uh 52 millimeter wheels and uh the measuring tape right here says that uh the wheels right now are less than 45 so I, I think i'm almost i almost warped 10 millimeters of uh usage on these wheels you know but honestly these are the best skateboarding wheels i have ever used you know they lasted me a really long time i've never had any problems none of that clacking kind of sound every time you skate you know when you flat spot your wheel i have never flat spot these they, are, they work very great for street transition and i love these so much 
All right, uh, so honestly, these are like by far my favorite skateboarding wheels ever, you know, because honestly, this is gonna be my personal preference thing, but I honestly think that Spitfire is better than Bones wheels. I skated Bones wheels, but the thing about it is, is that like, they don't feel like Spitfires to me. Like I've been skating these for so long that I got so adapted to these. And honestly, it's just, the way they grip, you know, like I skated bones, you know, I have a pair of bones, but I think I switched them out after like a month of skating bones because I just didn't like the way they felt. I know bones have different kind of uh, durometers and everything like that, different sizes. I get it, but it, it's just, I guess maybe I didn't get the right wheels that I preferably like. Maybe I might give bones another try to see if uh, maybe they're better than spitfires but personally i think that um spitfires right here are just the best for me you know i might review uh i have a pair of force wheels i want to review over you guys but i want to skate them first before i give an actual full review but the thing about these spitfires is that they could take one heck of a beating you know i never heard any kind of clacking noise you know that when you flat spot a wheel you can hear some kind of repetitive noise you know on every time you're skating it's kind of annoying and that's what my pig wheels did you know and uh pig wheels are just pretty decent i didn't really like those too much because they worked out way too fast you know even though they were conical i did not like pig wheels you know they 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 messed up so fast you can hear the flat spots on them and that was after like um, like two months of like skating you know honestly these spitfires right here i've been skating these for over a year and they have never let me down yeah they've gotten smaller but that's just because you're gonna every wheel does that every wheel you skate it's just they're gonna get small and they're gonna wear out you know so these right here have never let me down they've never flat spotted you know they always have a good grip especially for transition and uh street you know I, I just love these wheels you can't go wrong another thing that i got these wheels uh i bought them online i think off amazon you know because i was still at the time i was still new to skateboarding so i was still kind of skeptical on what kind of websites to buy my stuff from so i was like okay let me buy it off amazon and i think i bought these for roughly around 35 dollars you know and i know other wheels are cheaper but you kind of pay for what you get and i know these can almost go for almost 40 dollars for a pair of wheels sometimes i've seen 50 dollars for spitfire wheels believe it or not but honestly, I think you do get what you pay for, but I think I'd spend the extra 10 bucks just to get Spitfires because these will last you a whole year. And I think I'm going to buy another pair of these because these definitely have shrunk on me, but they're still very functional to this day. The only thing I do need to replace with these are my bearings because I have gotten these bearings in water and uh, check this out. Oh yeah, look, they don't eat. They don't even spin no more, you know? So uh, I do need some uh, bearings and I'm gonna do another review on Bones Reds because I think Bones Reds are also my favorite, you know? My biggest review on these skateboard uh, wheels are gonna be a 10 out of 10, you know? You can never ever go wrong with Spitfire wheels. Honestly, these are just the best ones I've skated out of all the wheels I skated through skateboarding. These right here are by far the best ones I have ever skated, ever. Here's also some clips of me doing some tricks, you know, on my skateboard. And yes, I was skating um, Spitfire wheels at the time. And honestly, they give me really, really, really good control. You know, um, you know, they give me the confidence. You know, these wheels right here, knowing that. Um, that they give good grip, you know, they're not gonna wear out. You're not gonna be worried that, oh my God, these are gonna wear out in like a month or two. No, 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 no. These Spitfires are honestly my favorite. You know, I choose them over any wheels in the market, you know? All right, so I'm gonna put these bad boys back on uh, my skateboard. All right, here goes one. All right, here comes the next one. All right, here comes the third one. Oh. Wrong way. <laughs> Last and not least. All right, guys, don't mind uh, the boards in the background. That's just my plan to take over the world, you know? <laughs> um, I did get my uh, skateboard set up and everything. All my wheels are back and intact. Everything's uh, back to normal. But yeah, um, tell me you guys' opinions. Do you guys like Spitfire wheels or do you guys prefer another kind of wheels? You know, do you think, do you guys agree with me that Spitfires are the best wheels ever? You know, because I personally think Spitfires are the best 
wheels I've ever skated based off my experience. Please uh, tell me your opinion. Should I skate other wheels? Give me another reviews if you guys want. You know, leave it in the comments to uh, let me know what you guys want me to skate. Like, should I skate more Richter's? Should I skate, um, you know, more Bones? Or should I, you know, skate Force Wheels, you know, more often? Do you guys agree with my opinion or not, you know? Because I really want to know what you guys think. Uh, please don't forget to like and subscribe on this video. And uh, don't forget to share it and uh, leave your thoughts and comments. And I will see you guys next time.